The headlines understandably focused on Kate Middleton's news that she had been diagnosed with cancer, but there was plenty more to her just over two-minute video statement. After weeks of rampant speculation about the absence of Catherine, Princess of Wales, from the public eye, following her January 2024 abdominal surgery, Kate addressed the world directly in a video published on March 22. Dressed casually in a striped sweater and blue jeans with spring blossoms in the background, Kate finally ended the speculation about her whereabouts over the past two months. Her absence had caused a wave of wild royal conspiracy theories that range from tragic to outrageous. One of the most critical questions Kate answered had to do with initial statements to the press that the condition which she had surgery to correct wasn't cancerous. And at the time, it was thought that my condition was non-cancerous. However, tests after the operation found cancer had been present. People also wondered about the princess's lengthy recovery time almost from the very start. It must have been something very serious. Without knowing the kind of planned abdominal surgery she was having, many speculators compared Kensington Palace's expected in-hospital recovery window of 10 to 14 days to time frames presented by medical institutions. For example, Upstate University Hospital in Syracuse, New York, lists the most invasive abdominal surgery hospitalization window as no more than seven days. This too was cleared up in Kate's video statement. She called it an incredibly tough couple of months for her and her family and thanked her medical team for all their work. As has been widely reported, Kate said she has started preventative chemotherapy, presumably to get rid of any remaining cancer cells. As you can imagine, this has taken time. It has taken me time to recover from major surgery in order to start my treatment. Kate clearly recognized that at least some of the speculation about her absence had to do with genuine concern about her health and well-being, and she expressed gratitude for, quote, the love, support, and kindness that has been shown by so many of you. Another reason Kate gave for her time outside the public eye? She had to explain what was going on to her children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. It has taken us time to explain everything to George, Charlotte, and Louis in a way that's appropriate for them and to reassure them that I'm going to be okay. The Princess of Wales understandably left some details about her health private, such as the type of cancer and exactly how it was detected. However, she offered a touching statement of support to those facing their own cancer diagnoses, one of whom is her father-in-law, King Charles III, who was diagnosed with cancer in February 2024. For everyone facing this disease, in whatever form, please do not lose faith or hope. Kate also indirectly addressed the elephant in the room, all those conspiracy theories. A common one suggested that Kate and Prince William were experiencing marital trouble. Her comments seemed directly pointed at dispelling rumors that Prince William was in the midst of an affair. Having William by my side is a great source of comfort and reassurance too. Now that what really happened to Kate is finally clear, the princess made a clear plea for privacy again suggesting she's aware of just how rampant public speculation had become. She said that she'd be back to her duties when she's able, but that's obviously not her focus at the moment. We hope that you'll understand that as a family, we now need some time, space, and privacy while I complete my treatment.